Hello. Ooh, how's everyone doing? I'm doing pretty good. I'm doing good, thank you. How are you doing? Right, let's turn it down so I can hear myself think. Where did I put it? Swamp got hello work. This is a perfect opportunity to procrastinate. Man's using Photoshop. <laughs> we call it Microsoft Paint, where I'm from. Close enough. All right. Oh. Let's get cracking. He put the mag in the gr Okay. That works. That works. Are we going to do the pistol grip right now? Hold up. Good. I'm glad you're doing good. All right. Yeah, it's pretty clean, dude. Pretty clean model. Well baked. Good topology. Good low poly too. All right. Intro over. Here we go. See the pistol grip. Pistol grip. Here we go. Oh yeah. Bad wells. Don't worry, we fixed them, bro. Don't worry about it. Can't even tell. You can't even tell, bro. Don't tell me that you can tell that. All right. Okay. Dylan, <laughs> dude, this meme is so fucking funny. <laughs> okay. All right. 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 Where's the pistol grip? There it is. Ooh, dude, this picture right here. This is gonna do it. Oh, are these on two different? Uh. Oh, is that not part of the grip? The top piece there? I guess not. Alright. Okay. Pistol grip. Hardware store. Uh, let's just do fucking... What are we, what are we thinking? <laughs> Fuck you, dude. I'm not gonna name shit. You know, I'll unname it. Phil Lair 21. There you go. How you like that? All right. <laughs> I know exactly who this is now. I know exactly who I'm talking to. Hope you're doing good, bro. Going ham today. Thank you, thank you. What's up, Neil Adam 3D? What's popping? Strange. Hope you're doing good, Neil. What's popping? One hundred. That's the wrong channel. That's the right jewel. That's a lot. All right. That's a lot. My mouse disappeared. There it is. 
Oh, this song goes hard, dude. Ready for this one, bro. There we go. Alright. Base material, go down a bit right there. Do this. Why is it going in? I thought I told it. Oh. There we go. Interessante. Although it looks just like the metal we made up here, so we gotta keep uh, keep going. Is there anything wrong because you're buffering each stroke? Got some layers. Hmm. If you're not like anchor pointing and it's lagging, that's pretty bad. I don't know what to do about that. But I know it lags during anchor points, so that, that's just a part of it. That just sucks. Rubicon. Nah, this doesn't really feel right. How's he wonder? Dude. <laughs> shader call did I have the shader windows view shader settings? Yeah, it is on high quality, yeah, but other than that, it's just default, no tone mapping, no none of that uh, post effects, none of that. Uh, autosave, thank you. Thank you, autosave. We need to go from black. We need to go kind of gray with it. Obviously. Obviously. There. There land. When you do diffuse in the noise, it just looks like shit. So you have to turn it down a bit. Oh, it still sucks. There we go. Like eight, that works. Alright. Start at Louboutin. Try breaking Perlin with flakes? Is that what happens? Can you do that? Is there a fill called flakes? I don't know. Flakes. Oh, fucking. Flakes. Flakes is a normal. Uh. We could try it. See what happens. We'll get kind of freaky with it, but. Uh, normal flakes. Right, we are destroying something here. Put a layer on top of Perlin. Oh, okay. I see what you mean. I see what you mean. How to fill flakes this shit. Set it to multiply maybe. Oh, here. and put flakes in it and multiply. Oh, okay. So like this you mean? It's kinda solid, dude. I'm not gonna lie, that's pretty solid. Damn, that's pretty good. I never knew that. I never knew that was a thing. Damn. What the fuck is this, dude? I don't... See, the problem is you turn on Blade Radio and you get just some fucking absolute weird ass music, dude. Damn, dude. Make them a bit bigger. Oops, I duplicated. Oh, yeah. Oh yeah, that'll do it. Okay, I'll mess with it in a bit, but... Hey bro, what's going on, man? Liu Gim. I like that name. Uh... Ugh, I have to do alpha. I accidentally imported all these as alphas instead of textures, so I have to, like, change it. Okay, yeah. Specs here is... Let's do that. 
Yeah, it's very hard to explain things in Twitch chat, I've noticed. One thing I've learned. <laughs> like a wizard. Hope you're doing good. Hope you're doing good. We got a lot of color in this too. I mean, it's just kind of a shitty photo, but we'll work on that. Conan Syntax. Double stream, hell yeah, you bet. You best believe. Double stream. Ooh, this is an interesting scene. We can get pretty wet and wild with that one. Cool. Cool. Let's turn the gloss down a bit and have the noise. Is it an olive green? Let me find a different picture with like neutral lighting. I mean, that is pretty neutral lighting, but it's pretty black, but we can try green. That might look cool. It's a good call. We got a senior artist in chat. Uh. Let's try it, let's try it. Just a touch. The lightest. A little, little drop of OD green. Ooh -hoo -hoo. Ooh -hoo. <laughs> yeah, my pocket. Whoops, I opened 3ds Max, okay. Sweet. It's not hooked up. Um, why is it not hooked up? Oh, because I'm exporting a different... Uh, Bison... Exploded mag, exploded stock, exploded... I'm not, like, showing files, am I? No, okay, good. <laughs> I was about to say. No. Dude, I have dealt with this for so long. Bison, painter textures, okay. Exploded. Yeah, it's still not uh, doing it. Let me see. Maybe we're not exporting the right folder. Mag, Bison, painter textures, yes. Mag. I am lost. I am lost. Uh, oh shit, I think I know what happened. Yep, okay, I figured it out. I renamed the model so it's exporting different textures now, that's great. Uh, diffuse, where's the gloss? There it is. And then we need to turn off sRGB. Right? That's what we did? Yeah. Okay. Cool. Alright, figured it out. Feedback on monkeys? I'm not sure I understand the reference. Okay. You love me, I don't know. Cool. Flakes is a cool thing. I like it. Aeoli. That's what I spelled right there. Aeolus. Edge. There we go.
Fine, I'll use a mask editor. What even is a mask editor? Is that a generator? That's a generator, right? Actually, could I use a UV border generator? I can't. I can use a UV border generator. Okay, cool. add some more breakup to it so it's not like a full generator you know this is just too loud all right all right we're shuffling this you know today i, I logged on to my fake Facebook account and I found that someone was using my account to sell sneakers like he had to be scamming people but like he was using my account to do it like well, whoa how long has this, has this been going on <laughs> so I, I fucking nuked it but like what are they cool singers not really they were purple lobsters which I think are ugly they were Jordan 4 OD greens and I forget what other shoe it was, but they were like, they were Jordan. So I mean, like, they're sort of cool, but you know, like, really? <laughs> it's, it's, it's so weird. Head stuff. Very strange. Very, very strange. I used to be into sneakers, great, I grew out of that one. Yeah, I used to be hella into it too. I still got my off-whites and fear of gods and stuff, but yeah, it is expensive, so I just, I think COVID came and like, didn't even go outside, so it was like, I'm just buying all these shoes for literally no fucking reason, so, like, fuck that. Me too, now I wear Skechers, yeah, dude. I wear... I got these. Those are my, my daily wares. But I got a few sneakers, you know. My off-white... Uh, um, what's it called? Off-white blazers. All Hallows Eve, the black ones. I got those. Vibram Five Fingers. What are those? Oh, the five... <laughs> That's the drip, dude. Drip. I know people that would wear those, dude. Not judging, but holy shit, they're ugly as shit as fuck. Can I do this? Yeah. <laughs> nice. Oops. It's the anti-trip, dude. Nah, man. Found the guy who's just not about it, dude. He's just not about it. He had to be there. Just had to be there, man. What about... Can I do a micro-height generator? Dirt. Oh, look at that. Inner micro dirt. Look at that. Wrong, and this is not where you belong. Uh, do this, hit it with a multiply. 
Balance it out, contrast it. Oh yes, look at Come on. Come on, doesn't get much better than that. Uh wait, uh, I'm on the wrong It's like a dark red kind of. Can I capture that or is that just gonna look weird? That might just look weird. See what happens. Then, uh, nuke the gloss. Cool. Let's do. Uh, this sharp surface on handle real surface or normal? Oh, um, the knurling right here. This is a normal, so I can. There it is. Yeah, it's all in the normal. Yeah, you would never model something in like this. That'd just be way too much. Uh, yeah. Make it nice and smooth too, so we can get some more separation. Ooh. Paint so to multiply. Next gen Nanite Ultimate Realistic Graphics using the new Lumen engine. Rendered in 4K, 8K, 720,000p. Dude. This music is taking me back, dude. That's why I listen to this music. Because it's like. It takes you back to the good old days, you know? I wonder if I should purl and noise this as well. What is hairs there? It looks like this. It's got these little hairs in it. I zoom in closer. Just a micro height layer, so it's not all just one even surface. To 720, get ready for 72,000p. This is what I picture when I hear this song. This is exactly it. Xbox 720 as the reference right now, dude. Oh shit, I missed a fuck ton of shit. Oh, sorry. Uh, thanks, Juice, Noob Station, Legume. Thank you, Andy. Thank you, Bob. Did you want critique, Bob? An abandoned pad dragon toy? Dude, what? <laughs> Dude, that's a sick name, bro. What's up, dude? What's up, dude? Abandoned Bad Dragon. Dude. Mod that guy. Mod that guy. <laughs> He's got the emoji. <laughs> dude, what? Boss, your check. I got it, dude. No way, dude. Okay, alright. Dude, that's so fucking... Alright, alright, right. we, have, we have to be mature here. We have to be mature. We have to be mature.
We need a stronger normal. Back. Oh yeah, we love our Slipknot here. Painting inside of Paint 3D, yeah dude. Microsoft Paint. Oh yeah. Can you add a translate filter? Does that work? Add filter so I don't have to go through and like transform. Nah, it's gonna pick up the UVs. You gotta go in each one by one and change the offsets. Cause I want them to be different. I'm trying to think of how I should do this. I think it needs to be matte, actually. Hmm. It's a tough one. Oh, this is a good reference right here. Check this out. Let's do the seam, because I know how to do that. Creature before I could... Where's my rectangle? Planar projection. <laughs> Did I need to like put a disclaimer that no, it's so what you're seeing is just me exporting it, but you don't see the export window. So, no, there is no substance uh, bridge. The marble, although, hey. If any developers are out there. Uh, let's do that as well. Do we have a better picture of it? What's this? Whoa. That looks sick. Alright, anyways. Let's do something cool. Let's just do something cool. Well, I got a deal. Put any of these new, there's a filler and a mask and just a scale on high divisions. I see. Okay. I will check those out. I'll check it out now, actually. Do that. Put any of these in your filler and adjust the scale and height of it. Okay, let's try this. Uh, import as texture to the other library. Okay, let's off the seam real quick. I like this one. This one looks cool. Let's try planar it. Do I need to levels it? I might need to levels it. Oh, uh, I see. Okay, I see. Okay. We can work with that. Okay. Shit out of me. Yeah, I like this. Cool, thanks.
I don't know, love them just, just hmm. Okay, let's try that. Well, if you don't level them, they're just kind of like a white, blurry kind of mask. Hmm. Perhaps I'm not doing it right. Oh. Even if it makes zero sense, I'd love to see an inward dent at the front portion near the trigger. Ah, so they pulled the trigger. Ah. Who is this guy in chat, dude? Got the best ideas I've ever heard in stream. That's a good idea. Senior artist. Posture check. Senior weapon man right here. Dude, seriously, man. What? It's crazy. The live and shit. Oh, one thing I noticed is that some of these are flattened. Can we do that? Actually, okay, let's do the scene. Because I'm getting ahead of myself here. Pick up. Set it to normal. Set the normal. Get a little bit of the noise in there. There we go. Oh, I love the song. Senior enjoy. You guys can hear the music, right? I'm not like going crazy again like last stream. I remember last stream it was like listening to music for like 30 minutes and no one was hearing a damn thing. There you go, right in the middle. Cool. Let's get crazy with it. How about this? Just turn off the turn up the gloss on it. Uh, we want the normal on it. Today I can hear the music. Hell yeah. I, I, I seriously try not to sing, but it's like it's ingrained in my brain. Let's do that. Let's crank the height a bit. Add filters. Let's let's get crazy here. Let's try some stuff. Blur. Slope. Let's try this. Try that. Blur. Position. Tense it. Whoa. Whoa, whoa. We got some weird shit going on. Let's try again. It's trippy. It is kind of trippy. Change the intensity divider, that should do it for us, since it... Tiling... Warp fuck with the source tiling? Oh, that's what I'm doing right now, yeah. Source tiling, yeah. I'm trying to get it kind of wavy, but I don't know if that's gonna happen. I know I'm sure it will, but... You brought up the flatting on the nerling, I can have another one of chips. Yeah, yeah, I'm not uh, quite there yet. The little chips and notches in it, I'm not quite there. Not quite there yet. We do height damage, usually last for my... Man, how do I... Hmm. What if I warp? Oh, I I ignored your comment, sorry. You should've, I should have warped it to begin with, there we go. Yeah, there we go. Not, not quite my tempo. Quite my tempo. Okay, let's try this. Maybe, maybe make it a bit thinner. It's, whoa, it's way too big. What the fuck? The 
the glass to overlay. Do it on the folder, don't I? There. Pick up some of the glass and the diffuse look like this. Maybe the seam should not be glossy. Maybe it should be that. Go thinner. Let's warp on it. Go thinner. Come on. You can do it. There we go. I don't know if I like this or not. Maybe same as the rest of the handle. I'm thinking that too. I'm thinking that as well because it's just not working as both. Do that. How about that? Hmm. Too much warp, maybe? I don't know. Maybe the height's too strong. Oh, is that what it looks like in the ref? The, the big one is a little much. Yeah, I'm looking. I'm experimenting. Something like that looks pretty cool. Something like that looks kind of cool. I think I'll rock with that for now. Big warpy. Just one more peaceful day. Way better? Yeah, I think so too. I think so too. This we nuke the gloss on. What is the playlist? It is fire. It is... This one right here. Early 2000s emo mix. Fucking goaded. No problem. No problem. Why is... Whoa, whoa, what? Why is it so big right there? What, what's this, this strip right here? What? What is this? Wait, what? That was weird. I don't know what the hell's going on there, but... That was pretty bitchin', I'd say. I just did that so fast. Oh my god, I'm so impressed by myself. Got the pearling noise. 
going to Sigma Moon. It's lonely. I need to turn off Steam. I keep getting fucking notifications. Steam exit. What else do I got open? Slack quit. Alright. Bump them out. Let's bump them out. See what we look like. A render. Uh oh, okay. Go did seem, I think so too. Although it might be a bit much. We get another light here. Albedo looks a bit dark. I yeah, can probably bump it. Bump it up. See what happens. Value. All right. Let's let's just try that. Let's try that. Something's just not right with the noise. Hold on, let me let me try this. We need like another layer of this. Let's fuck it with the normal. These these look super strong because the normal isn't helping it out. I don't know what happened. Looks kind of good, but I don't know if it's the right kind of plastic we're going for. Now that looks too much like we gotta stop doing that. That's like not good. Move that layer. better. You turn on the gloss. Yeah, we're too glossy, dude. I don't know. I always hit or miss with how it looks in the render with some of these materials. Oh, one thing I'm going to try, actually. I think a sharpen filter. I think I need a sharpen filter. Uh, where is that?
I think that'll do it. What's up, mate? How you doing? All right, we'll work with this for now. Look at this like yellow goop. Do we get that like yellow goop? Don't you save smart materials from older projects? It's a lot of repeating. It is a lot of repeating, yeah. I don't, uh... Not really. I mean... Kind of the, like... The beauty in it all is that... Every material is sort of different in its own way, you know? So... I try not to that much. For work, like... Oh, don't get me wrong, I'm smart materialing fucking everything, like, for work, but... Um, for personal portfolio stuff, I'm just sort of like, uh, I'd rather just make it, you know, and for the stream, you know, Sazi Daily, Sardin, Sardin. How you doing? But you're right, it is a lot of repeating, that's for sure. Also, because I'm primarily a view model animator, so I'd love if you were here to animate this next set. I guess I'm still at work. Oh, uh... Well, this model was made by... My friend Yegor, he's in chat, You'd, we'd have to make sure it's cool with him, but this, uh, there's a, certain things about this model that aren't ready to fully animate, I don't think. Um, for the most part it is, but I mean... Yeah, you could probably ask uh, Yegor, is he, you cool with that? I don't, uh... Doing, doing, just doing my thing. I feel that. I feel that, man. What was I doing again? Oh, the goop. Goop. Make it yellow. There's also this like brown shit going on there, so we'll do that too. I really wish I could just go to point oh one brush when I needed to, but I have to type it in because helpful features are not allowed. I think it's supposed to be the Okay. Oh, for gross dust like that, you can use a bitmap of sand for the color variation. Uh, I don't have that. I don't have a bitmap of sand, but that is a good, good uh, idea, though. But, uh,.
There we go. I like that better. Painting pixel by pixel is the new meta. It sure is. Always has been. Color pick. Found a gap. Found a gap in the model. Error spotted. Huh. All right. We get like more red, I think that's what it looks like. It's like up here, like... Let's really get into the pixels of this. Can I record these, I wonder? Oh, they're already recorded. They're already in my videos. I'd prefer you to not record it on yourself and repost it, so... Make it more shit color. Still, I still picked red, but I didn't. I need to take the height. Yeah, I'm like zoomed in on the pixels. You can't really see shit. Yeah. This is gonna look terrible, I think. Oh, so I don't think we're even gonna see it, but. Foster chick. Good call. Good call. Ugh. What's up, good boy? What's poppin'? Uh, what's that small line on the back of the grip at the top where it connects to the gun? I'm not too sure what this is, but I'm sure it's some sort of mounting uh, piece. But I'll have to do that. It's a different part of addiction texture set, unfortunately. So, well, not unfortunately, but you know. The small line you see going up the grid in the ref image. Oh, this top. Oh, I see what you mean. Oh, this thing. I don't know, but we can try to get it. We can try to work it in somewhere. See what happens. Uh, also, what does that say? What is that? Six and six over two? What is it? I think I need to find the right. Oh, let's actually. Yagor has in generously included textures that I don't have. Um, I did not import those. EP buys and. Oh, there they are. Well, shit, thank you. <laughs> uh, alpha project, there we go. Well. Gosh, dude, such a goaded individual. Insane. Thank you, uh, Kikilo2025. 
Appreciate it. 225. Look at that. It's even hand painted too. I think. This axe looks so cool. Okay. Where are we? Where are we? Oh, it is a metal. Oh, huh. Who knew? We just don't have enough res. Hmm, the res is kind of crappy. Foster check, good call. Give you some water too. Try something. Let's try this. Try the blur. But we do a levels to it. No, that didn't work too well. Thank you, nice guardian. Appreciate it. Hmm. Song used to be my anthem, dude. Should not it be a bit bigger? Yeah, maybe a bit bigger. I knew that. We're gonna go with that, I think. Hmm. That's what she said. <laughs> the dash angle is a bit different. Nah, I am not gonna go that deep into it. <laughs> Is the slash at a 72 degree angle? <laughs> Sedge. How did you increase the size of the stencil? Uh, you just uh, press 3, go to prediction mode, then you press S, and then you right click up and down. Go up and down. Oh, thank you. I appreciate it. Um, I don't think there's any much... I'm a dumbass. Not sure what else we can do to it. And then I swear I'll go away. Oh, the gloss effect that I have going on is not helping it out here. Oh, that's... Oh, it was suffocating. That's what it was. The diffuse was suffocating it. There we go. There we go. Okay. Um. Oh, 
I want to smooth some parts out, like some of the worn parts. Nothing is what it seems. Hydrate, here we go. Good call. Hmm. Cool, let's do that, yeah. Well, I don't want to hundred percent it, but symmetry as well. Oh, I got the goop. I gotta fix the goop. Liberate and eye eyeless are my favorite slip notes. Now let's cue them up. Liberate. Song. Add to cue. And what was the other one? Eyeless. Well, this song popped up while I was searching that one, so we gotta cue this one as well. Okay, there we go. I'm done with this one. I don't listen to this. Uh, what did you do to make the gloss look like that? The noise? Oh, just purlin noise, dude. Just purlin noise. With a UV generator. So I multiplied it in on these areas. Nothing special. Okay. I'm starting to think that we should not make this thing this glossy. <laughs> Probably, dude. I think what we could do to make a really cool effect is do this. Let's add generator. Yeah. Yes, yes. Thank you, Ramon, for for the follow. Uh, the fills are quicksilver materials. No, I haven't. Uh, one of them is a quicksilver material. This this one right here is quicksilver plastic old computer. Yeah, this makes a cool effect. Yeah, I think this looks cool. Why is it different diffuse though? Oh, yeah, we can't do that. All right, so now let's let's see if we can flatten some of these. Let's see if we can get creative with the normal here. Normal, set it to normal. Okay, you know what I need to do? I need to set the normal to replace. Give me a second. I gotta set this up. Uh, what's it called? Mag normal. Mag underscore normal. There, set that. Set it to replace. Set the... There we go. Okay. And the ref is the more smudgy roughness variation of the portions where the user grips it. Yeah, yeah, I haven't uh, gotten there yet. Don't worry. We're, we're, we're building our way up to getting the... I do oils. Okay, well, I do a lot of things last, but oils and stuff, yeah. I go out of order sometimes, so... Okay, so now we have the normal there. And we can edit the normal. 
Now, if we set the normal to normal, Hold on, I fucked up. Set that to normal. Okay, I set up, fucked up the layer structure. Hold on. There we go. Can I edit it now? I don't. <laughs> Seriously. Where did I put that layer? I don't. Alright, I guess I'll just make another one. Uh, new edge chips, I don't know. Set, the, okay, now. There, finally, edit the fucking normal, Jesus Christ. Whoop, I'm slipping in my chair. There we go. This might be a really dumb way of doing it. Hold on. Now, because with the height, you still have the normal peeking through. This is typically why I would never bake in a pattern like this. I need to put this at the top because I'm editing shit. There we go. Hey. What a nice, uplifting song. I should show this one to my mom. Actually, my mom would probably like it, actually. Man. No problem, dude. See what this looks like in the render? Sometimes it'll render kind of different. Pretty nice. It's pretty nice. Motherfucker. I have the perfect stencil for that oil strip right there. Uh, your assets... Is 
I wonder. I think to blend these in more, we should do more, like in the height. Kind of jumping around, but just doing whatever I feel like it. Where was that? Uh... I had a fill there where I grabbed it all. Where was that? No, 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 no. This one. Add anchor point. Curling. I symmetry that? No, I did not. Let's try something. more looks a bit much in here let's see how it renders if we don't do close-ups it looks kind of good I'll leave it for now Okay. Yeah. This one right here just fucking bothers the shit out of me. Okay. <laughs> All right. That's more oils and shit. I don't like that thing. Whatever that is, I don't like it. it needs to go. The signature stroke opacity clicks, dude. I'm telling you, man, you don't. No need for stencils, man. Who needs them? Hmm. Not sure what to do here. If I just do this, like... Hmm. 
I'm uninspired right here, dude. Uh... It looks so good with this technique. It does, thank you. It does, yeah. I don't really know what I'm doing. I'm not gonna lie, I'm like lacking reference. So we just copy Tarkov? What are they doing? What's Tarkov doing? Let's add some like diffuse stuff, maybe. I'll oh, see you, man. Take care, dude. Have a good one. Be safe. Don't do drugs. Don't do drugs. Tarkov adding baked lighting? They do that? Do they really? I mean, I know Unity is fucking dog shit, but... Do they really bake their lighting? On the guns? Oh, yeah, because when you, um... Because when you're looting in Tarkov, like... You can see when things are lootable, because they just have shitty, like... Cause it's like glowing in the in the dark. Yeah, yeah. I know what you're talking about. I know what you're talking about. Very bad. Very bad. These are the good ones, dude. Don't do drugs. Just give them to me. Sharpen fifty times. <laughs> I've seen quite a few models on ArtStation where people just sharpen the crap out of it, dude. Me personally? Could not be me, but... Uh, add multiply... I'm trying to get like some micro edge chips up there. Sharpen is fun. It's fun, it would also destroy your model in like two seconds, it's fucking sick. The glowing effect when something is little is because of the intention skill? I don't know, dude. I, no, that's no, it's because they baked their lighting. I think, because I mean, I play Tarkov, I'm like level two, you know, and I can just see like, oh, this car battery is glowing, so I just yoink my car battery out of there, you know. Um, what's the spec they're looking like? I didn't destroy that, did I? Okay, cool. It really does feel like they're still using Unity 2016 with the loading times, like, oh my gosh. It's disgusting, dude. How long it takes to load in that fucking game. Do you want me to show you the albedo on one of the guns? Uh, that sounds pretty NDA. I don't think uh, they would appreciate you showing me that. Uh, 
Uh, hold on, I need to read this text message. If the song's over, just end the fucking song, dude. People say it's the best game ever and the worst, dude. I don't know what it is, dude. It's certainly a game. But, I mean... Just the jank of it, dude. Like, when you're walking, you have to hold D so you don't so you don't slide to a stop, you know, like what kind of game mechanic is that, dude? Like like where you feel like you're fighting the controls of the game? I think it's pretty bad game design. Well not game maybe just physics, I don't I don't know, I don't know. I don't think it's that realistic. Yeah, there's not much uh, realism going on in that. Oh, I just realized we're looking at the Tarkov model. Escape from Tarkov. I have a cool idea. Your stamina is depleted after 15 seconds of running? Sure is. What's going on here? Yeah, armor three, especially when your guy runs out of stamina in three seconds. He's a, you know, 2042 elite trained soldier. And he's like, he's aiming down his sight and he's going, you know, it's like, come on, dude. Let me maybe start on the, re yeah, I don't, I can't stand that fucking game. What are they doing? Someone carry me in CSGO. Good luck. I got 1800 hours. Still dog shit. Played it last night. Terrible. Worst game I've ever played in years. <sighs> Let's do some more dirt. Add fill. Use our good old fingers dry layer. That's layer. Crap. Let's do that again, but let's make it oil. Oh, hell yeah, dude. Mass latch was nuts. 14 kills? Hell yeah, dude. Good for you. Couldn't be me, though.
Titel. Here's how much money CSK is. Yeah, this is kind of crazy. The knife that I unboxed the other day was like two hundred dollars, and it went up fifty dollars because of uh, since I've had it. Since I've had it. Yeah, I'm sure someone out there's probably made a few thousand dollars off those cases. Stonks. It's a major stonks moment, dude. We've gone too oily. Face away and pretend that I'm not. Start on the vagina pattern, dude. The cami vagina pattern. Oh my gosh, dude. You unboxed tonight? Yeah, I did last week. I unboxed a. Uh, what's it called? Bowie knife lore. Well worn. 250 bucks. My friend, oh my god, dude. My friend unboxed a knife the other day. It's a M or it's a M9 Bayonet Black Laminate. Factory new. It's like a thousand dollars on the marketplace. Insane. And then my other friend unboxed another knife. All in the span of like a week. And it's a uh, stiletto knife case hardened. Six hundred, seven hundred dollars. Crazy. How many knives we've unboxed? How much money we've wasted too? Don't get me wrong on that. We should have money for cases. No, you just buy the skin you want, dude. Honestly, it's cheaper. Why are you guys opening cases? Dude, it's like every game we play, you know, someone gets a drop. It's like, oh, you gotta open it, you know? So that's, that's what we do. Never meant to be so cold. So cool. Maybe a bit a little too crazy on these oils up here. I have like thirty dollars of shit kind of Yeah, that's yeah, that's typical. <laughs> you should feel lucky. Um, let's cry watching real CS betting group chat seeing the dude, that's what I'm saying, bro. Dude, if I had my inventory that I had when I was like 14 now, I'd be like a thousand, thousands of dollars. But new players has more luck. I don't know, dude. You're like 250 cases, dude. 20. Give me 20 and I'll unbox a knife right now, dude. Easy peasy. To be so. Yeah, like my TF2 inventory. Never got into TF2. I never, uh, never rocked with it. Case unboxing stream, dude, that'd be sick. Except I'd be fucking broke, but. Do I have a gambling addiction? Probably. Because <laughs> every time I get a case, I unbox it, so. 
But it's paid off. I think I'm pro I think I'm positive on my CS:GO cases because I unboxed a uh, Ursus Slaughter Factory new. I think it was Stat Trek too. Factory new Stat Trek knife, and uh, sold that for six hundred dollars or five hundred dollars. But I'm not technically not positive because I bought Battlefield um, 2042, unfortunately, with that knife. Gold edition and not my, the hundred twenty dollar version, mind you. I still think about that a lot. I like this song. All right, let's go with this song. I still think about that. Absolute waste of money. Could not have gone any worse. <laughs> I heard the game's good now, but like. I don't know if I. I was so. I was personally offended by how EA released that game that I may not go back to it. Back, just. To... Consumer grade souvenirs and blues. Hey man. My inventory's full of them shits too, man. Somebody told me. Full standard edition, no discount, dude. I pre ordered it. My uh, co worker still laughs at me for that, for pre ordering it. But. You gotta do what you gotta do out here, you know? Fuck that, dude. It's a bit dank. Yeah, no, it's a bit, uh... We'll, we'll probably mess with it in the render. BF4 nostalgia goes, yeah, dude. It really did. It got me fucking good, too. Because I didn't. I was never really a fan of the uh, World War One, World War Two games, but I mean, Battlefield, uh, the World War One game. That one was okay. But I was sick of World War Two. Don't worry, guys. The next one will be good. Don't worry. Can I do something? Let me try... Where do you get your stencils images from? Uh, all from textures.com. Textures.com. How can you discern what is albedo in reference? Sometimes glossy parts look like it would be an albedo. Um, it's a good question. Usually, I don't know. I mean, usually just diffuse stuff has color in it, you know? So it's also trial and error. A lot of trial and error.
Thank you, Acer, for the follow. I forgot that. Sorry. My bad. Unless I did get that. I don't remember. Who is this? Trust Company? I've never heard of this, man. Auto save. Imagine if you had to text your 200 meter spaceship and you put pixel specs. <laughs> Fucking sick, dude. Extreme close ups, dude. Let's see what this looks like. It looks a little strong here. Looks a little too dirty at the top. I think I'm gonna move on. I boofed this thing and I don't know where. I'm gonna come back to it. Let's start on the receiver, I guess. Well, hmm. let's do the mag. Since we're on the same texture set, let's just do the mag, I guess. This probably this part's gonna be fun, man. Ooh. up here's not right today. Nice. Oh yeah, look at that. Alright. I'll come back to that probably off stream just to touch it up and fix it because I think I ruined it, but... What is this thing called? Magazine. Turned off the normal map somehow. Floating triangle. Floating edge. Fired. Excuse me? Oh, because I didn't select that. There we go. All right, the normal map is on. I think these are decimation artifacts. Hmm. I think when we texture, we won't even notice it, so we'll be fine. Wow, we got a lot of shit to do. Oh, man. It's only been an hour and a half. All right. It's like this painted section right here. It's cool. All right. Let's go ahead. Oopsie. <laughs> Oopsie is an understatement. Kidding.
Thank you, John Bone Jones. What a name. A lot of good names in chat today. Castle's decided to give you a singular yike. Yike. Let's make this like silver metal. Oh, I see. Okay. Let's do that and do that and that. What's up, man? How you doing? We're big chilling today. Hope you're doing good. Ooh, that's cool material. Oh, here we go. Finally found like a 3D artist on Twitch. There's some good ones out there. But thank you, nonetheless. Ooh, my wrist just cracked. Ugh. Alex Coleman was a good one. Oh, I've never seen that guy. Never seen, never it's heard of him. So maybe these aren't silver, but the other reference, they looked totally silver. Of course, I can't find it. Um, maybe they're not silver. Uh, Look a bit more darker than silver. I think so too. Honestly, it might be cool to just make them silver. You know what? I'm gonna call an audible. We're gonna make it metal.
yeah, I think we're gonna go something like that. I think it's gonna look good. I'll pop it in out, brother. <laughs> Oh, good luck, dude. Oh, yeah, we're so chill, dude. Thanks for the follow, by the way. We're so chill, dude. We just smoke weed. Fucking vibe, dude. That was a joke. I don't drink. That was a joke. Legally, it was a joke. God, I hate doing medals like this. It's so hard to get these things to read, like, cool. But we're gonna keep going. Fuck, just use a dirt generator, dude. Fuck it. What, who are we talking about, dude? When it comes to rendering, do you have any antistropic slash flow? No. I'm not too sure what that means. Um. Flow. I think you'd have enough resolution anyways. She told me that she had a gun. Ooh. This is a tough material right here. It's a tough one. Yeah, I, I know what antistrophy is, but yeah, I know what that is, but yeah, I'm not too sure I follow. I don't think I have enough resolution at 2K to do the brushing rings. But, uh, yeah. Look at this edge chipped all the way around. Look at that generator. Pathetic. Good call. I was slouching. Good call. Yeah. One bottle down. Oh, yeah. Okay, so these materials are very different. These right here to here, super different. So we gotta do different normals. I bleed you.
Whoops, 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 whoop, whoop, whoop. Too cloudy. I could recycle. We could go to the stock. Should we go to the stock now? Uh, yeah, whatever. I need to try planer this before I forget. Once before. Um, that's what we do out here. We just make goaded fucking art, dude. Berlin. Scale it up. 500 million. There we go. Boom. Contrast it. Oof. Yeah. Whoops. I don't like this one. I like that song. I like this song. Pretty dirty metal, so, or but material at least. I don't see people's works have light shine on the edges of their guns. Looks really nice. Uh, well, that's just more of a rim light. I think that's what you're describing, right? Or... I'm not sure if that's... Uh, Hmm. Do I work with height at all? Oh yeah, yeah. I'm doing height right now. Hello? Oh. Uh, multiply. There we go. Height is very important, yes. Linear dodge add. Any custom grunges? Oh yeah, the whole library of them. Oh yeah. Yeah, we've got uh, all from textures.com that I've accumulated over the years, like something like this one. This one's pretty all right. Fuck, come on, there we go. I can grab a layer that we made before for this. Grab 
Green gloss, green gloss, edges, edge destroy. Is this it? Uh oh, we are, we are lagging. We are. Oof. We really did a number on it. We are lagging. Yep, it is. Pop it, Roach. Hell yeah. Try to get some of these highlights. Mm -hmm. Like that. Put their weapons on a magazine. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Yeah, I try to do something. Because, uh, I mean, to be quite honest, guns can be kind of boring. So. I want to try to do things that are more interesting to me, that make me want to do it, you know, so that's what I, that's one of the things I do. But gun mags have been around for a while, but Gun magazines, I mean. As far as people actually doing it, like, uh, in their 3D artwork, yeah. Revolutionary. Just kidding. There's other people that have done it before me. Echo Lima. Theirs are awesome, I love theirs. We're getting too ahead of ourselves with this edgeware. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. You are correct. Good, sir. Did you work with yes? Yeah, it's been done before. Oh yeah. Oh. I just did it better. Kidding. That was a joke. Shit. Oh, well, thanks. Oh. My poly made in plasticity? No, no, no. We, uh, this was made by my friend, Igor. Infusion. Infusion Trace Cicente. No, that's not how you spell it. 360. Infusion 360. I forget how to say 360 in Spanish. Go ahead, Diego. How's it going, dude? How you doing? What's the brushing here? I think there's 
You can see a little hint of it. We can do some milling. How about that? This is my signature touch right here, dude. No one else has done this before me. Can we see Yegor's art station? Do I have Yegor on speed dial here? I don't think I have Yegor on speed dial here. Uh, Yegor, link your art station. Oops. They started typing in my server. Wake me up inside. There he is. I've been living a lie. I think I could planar? Should be able to planar project this, right? If I do it uh, here too? This time, I can believe it. All right, here's the deal. I think we'll do this. Here, but not down there. It's just too much. Why is it not? What the fuck? Oh, dude, this song is goaded. What did I do? I seriously, like, messed this thing up. Just done this. Where is this thing in the UVs? Oh, there it is. Alright, we'll do this. Oh, I moved the pivot. Oops. Didn't know you could do that. What the hell? This is the dumbest shit. What am I doing? <sighs> okay, we're just, just stop. Just. Getting away.
It looks so awesome. I'm just, oh man, you just gotta understand. Nope, auto save. Just gotta understand. Uh, just trying to match materials, you know. Once you get the hang of it, it's really not that bad. More layers equals better result. <laughs> oh yeah. Trust me, dude. Fill layer 32. It's it's working. With murder. Take it ninety ninety. It looks cool. Some kind of sucks. Oh, it's Hoobastank. No wonder it sucks, dude. Is there a way to block Hoobastank so I never hear another Hoobastank song again? Or go to artist. No. Hoobastank has one good song and then never made a good song ever again. Yeah, that looks. Ha. Can you imagine? I posted that shit. Going under. Give me a second. Okay, never mind. All right, we've got a good base material going on here. Let's work on the mag, the main operation here. Okay, do I have a close up shot somewhere? It's a cool decal. Cool. Whoa, sorry about the mic. Well, thank you, Wimber. I appreciate it. Thank you. Us artists gotta stick together, man. Hard surfacers, you like to say.
Actually, oh, this is different. Oh shit. Okay. I was I was thinking they, they were the same material, but main tube. Do you make some materials and substance designer? Nope, all in painter. I do it all in painter. Although making some uh, materials in designer might be a good idea, but I mean, for guns, man, we're just making, you know, black metal. Black metal one, black metal two, you know, so I don't really, uh. Do you own guns? I bought my first gun a couple days ago, actually. What in tarnation stucco is that? Painted, shitty black metal. Making early in painter? Oh, you just gotta make it a... Make it a... What's it called? An alpha, and then you'll be good. In mind, I designed this ride. Looks good, my man. The wishy washy mag, but oh, thank you. Yeah. We're still gonna build it up a bit more. Oh shit, I fucked- okay. I actually destroyed it, but... Where did I do that? When did this happen? Okay. Okay, yeah, I don't not sure what happened with that layer, but it is over. It's only one Rush, there we go. 90. Gloss, let's turn down the gloss. Hmm. I don't think it's brushing. Maybe it is, actually. Well... Here, let's make a new folder for square thingy. Can we work on the same projects? Oh, hey! 
Cool stuff, cool stuff, dude. What uh, studio do you work at? If you don't mind me asking. Room 8. Oh. oh, I've heard of them. You guys make guns and stuff? I think I've seen you guys on Art Station, yeah. You guys got some pretty cool stuff. Wait, ah, damn it, what am I doing? We do all sorts of things. Ah, cool, cool. Good to meet you. Dodge. Ah, let's try something different. Texture. Oh boy. Riddle me this. Big Bob, the art lead, comes now. Ask you to ch to do changes that impossible to without mesh modification like Ben's dinks. Oh no, dude. If they... Look, if I make something, and then a client says, oh, actually, when we animate it, your hand is clipping through the receiver or something, you know? Or the, this is in the wrong position. You always, we always go back and change it. So we'll break the low poly, break that bad boy open. And we'll, uh, we're always making changes. Yeah, so nothing is ever really set in stone, if that makes sense. However, we would like to consider it uh, frozen right now, but, you know, like, uh, whatever's here is here. <laughs> but, uh, nah, man, production is very always, oh, this uh, didn't turn out right, or we didn't take into account this animation, you know, yeah. something like that. I hate Bob. Bob is an asshole. <laughs> True that. Expecting victim. Sally, if we want, where you can always find me. We all know a Bob. That is truth. Wish this never ends. So now I want to add noise that's independent of this little square thingy, so we're going to make noise up here. Uh, subtract. Actually, don't, doesn't... Oh, you know, I could have... Used Quixel Polymer. I totally forgot about that material. Oh well. Bob Enjoyer. <laughs> uh, Bob thinks he knows what's right. Or they. She. Maybe it is a she. Who knows? It. Bob is not real. Bob is a figment of our imaginations.
sometimes I hit the anchor point and it puts down a color selection. So, Painter, could you please fix that? Bob was probably sitting on that email client manager. <laughs> Dude, you've thought this out a lot, haven't you? You were waiting for this conversation to happen. About oh, fucking Bob. Miss you. Oh, uh, oops. Multiply this layer, set this one to Berlin noise. Okay, okay. Been cooking it for three months. Nice. <laughs> uh oh. I did not use 3D Perlin noise. I almost crashed the computer again. I mean, uneven edge for black rectangle thingy with just, uh, oh, just warp, just a warp filter. It says Bob lives in time space. <laughs> Bob is always fucking watching, dude. Bob, he's probably watching the stream right now. He's ready to say, uh, this mag isn't animatable. animatable. He's ready to make Yagor go back to step one. Find the words to say. Only one who can face Bob. Jerry, Jerry. Dude. Jerry ruins the game. The finance team ruins most things, so. Love that. In fact, money is probably the thing that ruined the game industry. Not ruined, but you know. Hmm. But you would have no job without no money. That is true. That is very true. Grunge fingerprint is a goat. It really is. Ooh, fair. It's actually like a great, uh, great little thing. Uh, how low do you usually go for the diffuse before getting too black and breaking PPR? That depends, like Unreal kind of sucks, you gotta go like pretty gray with it, but uh... Is there like an exact value I can... Linear... I go a little under 0.2, so maybe like uh... I do like a, well, actually 0.05, is that what I'm at? No. I'm at 0.004. I don't really like concern myself with breaking PBR while I'm rendering. You know, when you work in the industry, clients will give you um, values that are too dark. You know, they'll give you a range of values to that you can't go under. So I think you'll you'll be fine going pretty dark for your portfolio. But uh, just make sure you don't render at uh, pitch black. So let's actually export this and see what we get. I haven't exported it yet, actually.
Actually, why PBR are not dealing well with low values? Oh, it's just, um... If you go super dark in-game, it looks pitch black, and you don't want pitch black in your game. See, like, this black right here is... I'd call it perfect. If you would. Pitch black as a job. Oh, where's What if we warp Perlin noise? What do we get? Same with white too, yeah, you don't want to blow out your white too. And sometimes saturation of the different colors and stuff, they care about that type of stuff too. You want to fake holes, use pitch black, but for black. Yeah, yeah, use pitch black. 0.025, yeah, yeah. Geller Field, what's that? Why is it so contrasty? I don't want contrasty. Uh, did you know that plastic, much like metals, are under constant heat changes? That's pretty cool. I did not know that. I did not know that. The more you know. I could stencil something in like that, dude. Oh, whew. let's try it. I should add some like dirt real quick, real quick. Ah. I wonder if I have a stencil that looks just like that. I just plugged in the same stencil. I think we just need to turn down the spec on this one. Actually, I need to do a paint layer. Undo all this shit. Undo all this. Okay. Redo it. Let's do something like that. 
But let's turn it down right here. I am realizing the error of my ways. Add a paint. Let's see what happens if I do this. Okay. Yeah. Hustle check. Good call. Make it do work if you shine light. Yeah, good to know. It's kind of cool. I didn't know that. Hmm. Good call. Good call. Where's that fucking filter, man? Just you worry about animating the model is it's okay with it if... Um... Yeah, that'd be cool, yeah. Yeah, go for it, dude. Um... If you're talking to Yagor, then yeah, you... It's his model. I'm just doing the textures. I'm gonna post this on my portfolio, but... Just looks like shit, doesn't it? Yeah, just um, the only thing I have is just don't post uh, the texture channels like uh, these channels or the Substance Painter project files anywhere. If he wants to publish the model, that's fine. But, uh, Bob is not happy. Don't want height. Do not want height. On gloss. For me, I just need the texture images in the model file. And yeah, yeah, that's cool. Yeah, yeah. Do you have a portfolio, man? I uh, see it. I feel like maybe this mag just looks better if it's duller. I mean, blend it with the blue spray more so.
That's cool. Cool stuff. Should be cool. Although you need to remember that this thing right here is not showing. There's supposed to be bullets coming out right here, so you'll have to like figure that out in animation to how to kind of hide that, but... Man, it looks like shit. It's like trash. I already regret. <laughs> it's alright, it's alright. Man, I need to stick with one reference image and go for it. I'm using, like, bouncing around here and it's just leading to really bad results. Uh, I think it'll be better if I make the mags smoother. Hmm. Uh, yeah, no one will complain. Just fucking people. People will always be people. Gun people are the worst too. So <laughs> go on, go on. Yeah, I think I need to make this smoother. Could kind of differentiate it from the different. Uh, Metals that we're going to be doing. I think I'll do that, yeah. I see a very small hint of brushing to the surface. Shall do that as well. I'll turn on the music. Control C. Rushing at black mask at fill. The big tube. What? Oh. Uh, I could planer this, right? Only when I stop to... Cool. Neat. Can I get glossier? Kinda sucks, I'm still net trying to get this base material to look right. Just not quite there. Maybe something like that. I just want it to look cool at this point. Alright. Let's do that. Let's turn down the brushing and we'll call it for now. Be very subtle. There we go. Cool. Hello, Pusha. What's poppin'?
Tuesday. Hope you're doing good. Uh, looks good. Maybe he's breaks or Yeah, we're not. Yeah, man. Thanks, thanks for the feedback, but we're still going, dude. We're not. We are nowhere near being done. Thank you. Appreciate it, though. I'll do, uh... Why is that not working? I like this base. Yeah, I think I think it just looks better as smooth, you know. But we'll see what's going on. Your texturing really fast. Eh. I think this is that fast. I'm trying to this looks like cool, but like I'm trying to figure out how to get it to work. Like this stencil looks pretty sweet. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I think this will work, but we just have to kind of remove some of the super high, the super small stuff. We just have too much, it just looks stupid, so... Gorgeous, thank you, thank you. See how this looks. Coming along, it's coming along. Whoops, whoops. All right, cool. Let's go with this for now until we spot any error. Ooh, this thing is terrible. All right, let's try this. Let's make a dirt generator, but make it oil. How about that? Dirt. Where are you? There you are. We do this, but make it oily. Yeah, Whoops, uh, blur slope, there we go. Uh, it changed the tiling, there we go. That's pretty fucking cool. I don't. That's pretty cool. I don't. Shit. Hey. Pretty good. Who's your favorite music artist, Dan? Uh, Linkin Park. Linkin Park, by far. Favorite. All time. Easy. 
Alright. Let's try to add some more interesting stuff here. Oh, excuse me. Love them too? Hell yeah, man. Oh yeah. Fiction paper. I know there's a way to hide Geo, but just can't fix it. Oh, it's the um you see my mouse on screen? Can okay, yeah. It's uh this thing right here. Well, you can hide Geo with the top right, go to texture set list, and you've got the eyeball icons, or you can do the 3D Geo mask, which I don't do ever. I don't like it. But, um, yeah, you've got your eyeballs at the texture set list. I think that's what you're looking for. Oh, me back. It's like you nev you'll never even know how I made that scratch. Like, I just, I literally just, like, come on, like, it's, like, it's a perfect scratch, almost. But it doesn't work. Oh, we got a blurry mask here, hold on. Huh. I'm not really sure then, because 3D Geo Mask, it should work. Well, I mean, obviously everything should work, but you know. That should be a GIF. Oh, wait, hold on, Brubosh. <laughs> yeah, I guess. I mean, it's like. <laughs> Yeah, it's just, it's, it's just the it's the cheesiest, like hackiest fucking way to make fucking scratches, and it just turned out fucking perfect. <laughs> Change the levels a bit. Found it fine. How good, good stuff. So, now that I fucked with it, uh... This one's too linear. I had to fuck with it because I messed with the levels, but... I think it's still good. I think it's still good. Don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. Ruined. Ruined. Artwork. Ruined. You'll be the death of me. See, this was like. Pretty good.
What stage in your pipeline you don't like the most? Low poly? Fuck that stage. With the fusion workflow? Fuck that. Low poly. It's awful. Terrible. Yeah, Higor said it. Couldn't have said it better. Let's do some weird stuff with the spec. Let's get, let's get a little wet and wild here. Alright. Gonna deviate from the reference. Oh, actually, well. You can see the oils here. So, maybe we're not too far off. Okay, we're too far off. There we go. Eyes are a little dry. Rainbow spec? Nah, I'll think about it, maybe. This ref has too much noise in the diffuse, dude. Fucking idiot. Could you imagine? What do you mean you've never seen it done before? I did it on my, uh, did it on my Galil. You try it. Let's try it out. I think I got a rainbow in here somewhere. Rainbow. Yeah, I do. There it is. Wait, no. Pearl? Is that what it is? Hmm, wait, where is it? I know I have a rainbow in here somewhere. I need to go to a different folder. There it is. Don't you like using a tablet for painter? No, 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 no. There's too much accuracy in clicking these, clicking these things and moving Adjusting sliders, there's I cannot use a, a uh, tablet. Tried it, but you know sometimes when my mouse, my mouse wheel, the scroll wheel always breaks. This thing's a piece of dog shit. So um, there's always like it feels like I'm using a tablet sometimes when it breaks because you have to maneuver it in a special way. Uh, what do I want? HSL, HSL. Yeah. Maybe it just a tiny bit, like leaking out, like right there. I don't want to make this thing look like a fucking side of a goldfish, you know? But I think maybe a touch of it will do. Oh, we actually, if we do just do one, I'd imagine it would probably leak here because this is where the bullets are. Exploding, so I'll, I'll do this. I'll do this. Uh, take this one out. Take this one out. What is this spec map? No, it's not a uh, smart material. Actually, I don't know where I got it from, so it's probably best that I. It's just a. Uh, if you look up like 
mother of pearl um it'll give you kind of a similar look and then you can just kind of hsl it use saturation lightness It is pretty cool. It is pretty cool, that's for sure. Okay, but now, back to what I was doing was... Although... Hmm, Non-rainbow spec. Ruined. 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 Kind of crazy how much of an effect you can get from just barely shifting the spec. Kind of nuts, honestly. Okay, we'll do this, but we'll do... we'll break it up with a bunch of shit. Uh... Imagine this thing's been reloaded a couple thousand times. That's what I'm doing here. Oh, I see what happened. I painted through the holes that don't exist. Joke, 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 joke. Oh, I painted through these too. Okay, let's go with that. What does this look like? Not good, that's what it looks like. Set the numbers before I forget, because that's like something that I forget. Because remember when I posted a model and I misspelled some like Russian, Russian misplaced a Russian character and it, or a Cyrillic letter, and it never heard the end of it. And the comment got the most likes on all the project. Don't have the right font for that one, I don't think. I notice a lot of skilled artists use LB. Well, a lot of skilled artists use metallic rough too. But the uh, difference is just 
the way the game engine works. And right now, I like texturing in spec gloss. I think the specular gives you nice, I mean like, I don't know how to do this in Metal Rough, I'm not gonna lie, like the rainbow spec. So it, uh, I feel like it gives you more freedom, so that's why I do it. But um, one thing I'm noticing is that this oil shit has got to go. Attainable. Or maybe I have it in the diffuse, actually. Yeah, I accidentally had it in the diffuse. Uh, you can get rainbow spec in metal roof. You can't do rainbow spec? There's a way, but it's just like, you have to use it, make it metallic and be weird about it. By rainbow spec, you mean tempered metal? I mean, this, uh, rainbow effect that I have in the specular channel. Oh, you can't see the channel, sorry. Um, but everything I do here can be done in, um, metal rough. It's just a bit tricky, so... I think changing that channel, taking off the diffuse actually helped a lot. Yeah, it did. We got some weird stuff. We got like this brushing effect going on up here that I didn't notice before. You do it with anchor points, a bit of a base color, yeah. So in the mental roof, it doesn't reflect like that. Yeah, you'd have to get a little, a little wet and wild with it. You got a seam here. What seam is this from? Uh, rear piece. Oh, let me color code this shit. Uh, magazine, make it orange. What layer is causing this? This one. Because it is UV projected and not triplanered. Close enough. Posture check, good call. Oof. Starting to sink. These oils need to fucking go. I don't know where those came from. Probably my favorite Blink-182 song right here. Stupid. It's unsafe. I would like to mask her. That's pretty sick. Sometimes when I'm bored, I like to just stare at the world space normals. Yeah, the world space normals is pretty cool looking. Because on one side it's red, and on the other side it's like blue, and it's like, whoa.
We got this milling effect, let's do that. I need to change my alpha. If we're fucked up, you're... One day I'm going to learn what the compare mask does. One day I will. Uh, 90s museum, yeah. You ever use pass through? I do, yeah. Uh, not so much here, but uh, for client work I will use pass through. That's pretty sick. I wonder if it would be cooler to just do this. No, 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 no. Come 41 is what we're listening to. Come 41. Oh, I see. Hold on. This little square thingy. Give me my shape brush back. I made a bad misinterpretation. Uh, what does pass-through do exactly? It's like, um... I don't know how to explain it, but like... If I needed to edit things below it, you can set this layer to pass-through. It will, like, go through the layers. I don't know. I don't know how to describe it. It's only like... Um... Like, if I wanted to edit the entire gloss, of this entire thing, I would see, make a paint layer, set it to pass through, and then add a filter. Oh, it takes all the info from the layer. There you go. It takes all the info from the layers below. It was better than me. So I never, one thing I never learned was like all the blending modes. I don't know what they do. I mean, I know what like dodge add and like inverse sub does, but like screen. I don't know. <laughs> it actually applies the effect from layers below to the top. Ah. Interesting. Uh, what's this song called? Oh, it's called uh, Still Waiting, Sum 41. I love using soft light. I'll use soft light. Soft light is good. Overlay. Yeah, yeah, those are all good. Yeah. Overlay. I do overlay a lot. Um, I think, you know, the, all these came from like Photoshop, you know, and I never really learned Photoshop. Like really learned Photoshop. UVs are skewed here. Hey, no problem. Divide can you use on edgeware masks. Divide, okay. Yeah. The thing with this is there's so many ways to do, like, everything, you know? Let's go.
because it's in the Sherpa country. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm trying to think of where I've used divide before, but nothing, nothing's popping up. That's what's good for adding filters. Yeah, yeah, that's what I use it for. I use it at the, the very top, like the sharpen filter that's passed through. So it's affecting everything, you know. Let's go. The more I know, the more you know. Luck. Good looks. I don't think I want too many edge chips along these things. Ah, oh, wait. If I just multiply, but instead of making something darker, it makes it brighter. Good to know. Well, that was the end of that playlist. Holy shit, it's been three hours. Five? Yeah, I gotta call it there. Just about, yeah, I think I gotta call it there for now, unfortunately. Could not paint in that cool, uh, we need to lower the height on this before I Great stream, thank you, thank you. One for the books, hell yeah. Are we looking? Way too green on that pistol grip, I think. Man, what did I do to this pistol grip that just ruined it, dude? Did I just like nuke the gloss on it? Is that what I mean? I did just nuke the gloss and just ruined it. I'm glad you got to learn some things. That's what we're all here for. Education. Hmm. Now me trying to figure out where the fuck I added this layer. Oh boy. Where the hell did I Wild. This is wild how messy painter can get sometimes. Never. I want a monitor arm so I can show my face. Dude, real gamers turned their keyboard vertical and slid their monitor to their face. That's what we used to do, we used to do back in the day. Yeah. The horizontal uh, vertical keyboard. That's what we used to do. It's crazy. They still do that, huh? Pros, you'll see them. It, I mean, it's terrible for your wrist, but it's just. Oh, who started it? Some of the players would do it, but then other players would just, like, 
do it to like a normal extent, you know? <laughs> Doing it right now. Yeah, I mean, a little bit of bend is good because that's how your wrist like kind of naturally curves in, but like... It always hurt my wrist, so I never. I'm, I'm a horizontal gamer, but uh, actually, back in the back in the day, day, I used to be. I used to be pretty vertical. Actually, never mind. I lied. Better with one. Yeah, it is always better with a monitor arm. That is true. But um, yeah, I gotta end it there. But uh, thank you all for tuning in. And. Uh, Catch you next weekend, probably. Some more textures. Maybe some UVs, actually. I think I finished the low poly on my gun, uh, my revolver last night, but... Uh, we still have a bit of work to do on this mag. And then... I might revert some of the changes on the pistol grip. It looks a little bit too dirty right now. So... Yeah, thank you guys. Nice to see you too. So... Wish y'all the best. Pog UVs, they are not Pog, but we'll see. I think I gotta make it not green. They like the green. Unfortunately, but uh, yeah, thank you guys. Alright, that's gonna be it. See y'all later.